The West would not be the West if it had not been for those brave men. They portray the Buffalo Soldiers of the American West, inspired by others who have done the same. One day I was at a parade and I saw this group of men riding on horseback. And I get emotional when I think about it. And I go, who are those guys? And I found out they were Buffalo Soldiers. I had never heard of them. I'm an educator. Fred Applewhite portrays a first sergeant, along with Scott Johns as first lieutenant. Both are real life Army veterans and former Denver school system administrators. High school principal, athletic director, not once did I hear anything about the Buffalo Soldiers. So they make it their mission to share a story rooted in a history shared by all. We demonstrate some of the mounted shooting, saber techniques, and then some of the formations and drills. But the coronavirus pandemic means shows scheduled across the western states are now canceled. They depend on donations to take care of these performers and those donations are running out. The organization needs about $6,000 a season for grain, vet, and farrier fees, right? A GoFundMe page has been set up to help. The clothing, equipment, we all pay for out of pocket. We're just looking for help to make sure that the horses are taken care of. They haven't given up hope. They will ride throughout the West again. We can all meet again and gather and celebrate the traditions of the Buffalo Soldiers. And continue to share this incredible part of Colorado's rich history. These men who gave so much and got so little in return that their story is not forgotten and continue to share this incredible part that better? of Colorado's yeah. rich history. Yeah. So if you'd like to help, we have a link to the GoFundMe page set up on our website homepage. Just go to kdvr.com and click on this story. In Brighton, Shaw Turner and Bandit, Fox 31.